Assalamualaikum and a very good day to you all. In this video, I would like to share with you about a uh, simple discount in mathematics of finance. Okay, uh, first we discuss the concept of the formula a little bit, and then we are going to upper uh, discuss two ex uh, two examples. Okay, to train our. Uh, what we have learned in the formula okay now uh, unlike simple interest okay simple discount is different okay so why because okay for example i give you this one i compare with the table eh? now in simple interest interest are okay we apply for a loan we apply why i spell apply wrongly we apply a thousand ringgit loan and then we get a thousand ringgit loan and then we pay back thousand five thousand fifty. But in simple discount, okay, simple discount, okay, you apply when you fill up the form, eh? When I fill up the form and then you give it to the bank, okay, we give it to the loan shark, okay. You apply a thousand ringgit loan, but you get a discounted value. Um, let's say uh, 950. Okay, but unlike simple interest, you pay more from the what from what you apply, you only need to pay back a thousand ringgit okay that's the difference actually anyway also you pay more okay it's just that when you get the uh, money the amount is discounted at the at the start of the period okay uh, okay now good so so that's the difference, the con uh, the conceptual difference of simple interest and the simple discount situation. Usually, simple discount, uh, some kind of, uh, some along or some uh, some credit company, if the small financing company like not banks, not bank one, okay, or even along one, they will do this kind of simple discount style, okay. They are not. Uh, some some of them are not using this one. This one, uh, simple interest are usually done by a bank. But nowadays, I think not many banks do this one also. They do the compound interest one. Okay. Uh, so, what is the formula involved? Okay. Let's go through with that. So, it's D. Big D equals S D T. And then we have the second formula, proceed. S minus D. Okay. So what are these uh, sim uh, symbol means? Okay. We go down here. Okay. Maybe I get rid of the. Wait. Stop. I get rid of that. Okay. Good. Okay. Now zoom it like that. Okay. Good. Now. Okay. Uh. So. You see D stands for simple discount. The S is for amount or the face value. Okay. D is the yearly simple discount rate. T is the discount period in years. Okay. Same in the in the previous video about simple interest. The T, the period must be in years. If we get in days, we must divide by 360. Okay. In simple discount, we divide by 360 only. Okay, no need to divide by 365. That's only for simple interest case. Yeah. Okay, so uh, let's proceed to the, the first uh, example. Okay. Hey, sorry. Before that, uh, okay, you see the uh, proceed here. Maybe I use different color. Eh? Eh, cannot different color. Eh, eh why? Mm -hmm. Tak apalah. Okay, now this one. This proceed. Okay. So, you see this simple discount over here. Where is the proceed? Proceed is the amount that you get. Okay. You see, because this, the amount of 950 already a discounted amount of 1000 minus 50. Okay. So, the simple, the discount amount is 50 ringgit in this case. Okay. So, let's uh, proceed. Oh, wait. I forget. Okay. 
proceed also this one s minus d d is this one right so s d t so this one s can factorize outside one minus d t okay so this also the set the formula important formula that we can use okay so let's proceed this one okay justin got 4,800 for a 5,000 loan he applied from Bank Bantu Rakyat. The bank charges a simple discount rate of 5% per year. What is the duration of the loan? Okay, now. He got 4,800. So this is the proceed. Okay. 5,000 is the face value. Okay, so it's the S. Okay. And 5% is the D. Okay, so the proceed equals S1 minus D, T. Okay, okay, in this, uh, in this chapter, please do not shorten the proceed by using only letter P. Okay, because P means principal. Okay, not the discounted amount of loan that we get when we use simple discount rate. Okay, so please do not shorten this proceed to be P. Eh? Just spell it out, proceed. Okay, so proceed, which one? 4, 800, and then S is 5,000. 1 minus D is 5%. Don't forget to translate it into 0 0.05, 8.05. And then the T that we have to figure out. Okay, so I think we need to divide that one. Divide five thousand, thousand, thousand. Point nine six one minus point zero five t, and then minus minus zero point zero four, zero point zero five t. Oh, you minus, correct? Minus correct. Okay. And then divide by 4 over 5. Okay, so t is 4 over 5, 0 0.08. Correct. 4 over 5. Okay, right lah. Eh? 0, point 0 over 8 lah. 0 over 8. 0 over 8. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes lah. Okay. So that is the duration of the loan. 0 0.8 years or can change to month Okay, not nine month point six. Uh, okay, but just leave it like that, lah. Okay, okay. Let's go into the second one. Okay, Putri wants to borrow eight thousand for a duration of two hundred and forty days. Find the money she will receive if the bank charge a simple discount rate of nine point three seven five percent. Now he she wants to borrow eight thousand. She wants to borrow. So this is the S. Okay, she will receive is the proceed okay she will receive all the money she need okay is the proceed okay uh, so yes so duration of 200 days is the t lah but the t must, must divide by 360 days huh? okay so this is the d so proceed proceed equals as 1 minus d t a t Okay, so proceed, we don't know that the, uh, the proceed is the one we want to know lah. Okay, 8,000, 1 minus what DD is 0 0.09375. Okay, don't forget to change it into correct decimal. And now the T is 240 divide 360. Okay, and then uh, calculate lah. Okay, we are. Use my calculator. 240 divide 360. That one. Multiply 0 0.09375. 9375. Okay. And then 1 minus that one. And then multiply by 8000. Okay. So what we get is RM7500. So this is the... Um, proceed amount okay the amount or the amount that she will receive from the loan that she asked okay i think that's all thank you for your time and attention assalamualaikum have a good day